When people talk about hair regrowth, one name always comes up, minoxidil. It's FDA approved, it's widely used, and yes, it can help. But what if you don't want to use minoxidil? What if you tried it and didn't see result or you couldn't tolerate the side effects? The good news is there are alternatives. Some are medical, some are natural, some are lifestyle based. In this video, we'll explore the main alternatives to minoxidil, what science says about them, and how long it really takes to see results. Let's start with the obvious question. Why even look beyond minoxidil? Well, first, side effects. Some people experience scalp irritation, dryness, dandruff, or even unwanted hair growth on the face. Second, minoxidil only works for some. Around 40% of users see significant regrowth, but that leaves 60% who don't get the results they hoped for. Third, it's a lifelong commitment. Stop using it, and in most cases new hair will fall out again within months. So yes, minoxidil is helpful, but it's not the only option. Let's start with the medical alternatives. Finasteride. This oral medication works differently. Instead of improving blood flow, it blocks DHT, the hormone that shrinks hair follicles. In studies, 80 to 90% of men stopped losing more hair on finasteride, and many saw regrowth, but it comes with potential side effects, like reduced libido or mood changes, which is why not everyone uses it. Dutasteride similar to finasteride but blocks even more DHT. It's sometimes prescribed off-label for aggressive cases, though it has a higher side effect risk. Microneedling. This involves rolling tiny needles across the scalp to trigger wound healing and improve absorption of topicals. When combined with minoxidil or natural serums, some studies show up to four times better results compared to minoxidil alone. Low-level laser therapy. Yes, the helmets you see online. They use red light to stimulate cell activity. Results are mixed, but some clinical trials show thicker hair density after 6 to 12 months of use. So medical alternatives exist, but like minoxidil, they require consistency and patience. Not everyone wants medication. Some prefer natural or lifestyle-based alternatives. Nutritional support. If you're low in iron, vitamin D, or zinc, Correcting that can make a huge difference. For women especially, iron deficiency is one of the top hidden causes of hair loss. Herbal oils, rosemary oil, pumpkin seed oil, and caffeine shampoos have shown promising results in small studies. For example, a 2015 study found that rosemary oil was as effective as minoxidil after six months, but with fewer side effects. Stress and sleep. Chronic stress raises cortisol, which can trigger shedding. Poor sleep makes it worse. Managing stress and aiming for seven to nine hours of sleep can reduce shedding and support regrowth. Scalp care. Healthy circulation matters. Scalp massage, derma rolling, or even just proper cleansing can support better follicle activity over time. Are these as powerful as minoxidil? Usually not. But for mild cases, they can stabilize hair and improve thickness. Here's the part most people underestimate. Timing. Hair grows slowly, about one centimeter per month. That means with medication, you usually need three to six months to see clear improvement. With natural methods, it can take 6 to 12 months of consistency, and even then, results vary by genetics, age, and cause of hair loss. This is where tracking matters. Without data, you'll give up too soon, or think something isn't working when it actually is. Traditionally, people tracked with before and after photos. Dermatologists still do that today, but it's not always reliable. Lighting, angles, even wet versus dry hair can completely change how your scalp looks. This is where technology helps. For example, myhair.ai uses AI models trained on thousands of scalp photos. It measures bald spots, counts hairs, and shows whether your density is improving, stable, or declining. That way, if you're trying rosemary oil, microneedling, or finasteride, you know whether it's really working. It's not about branding, it's about turning guesswork into data, so you stick with the right plan long enough to see results. So, what's the truth about alternative to minoxidil. If you want medical options, finasteride, dutasteride, microneedling, and lasers are the strongest contenders. If you prefer natural, nutrition, rosemary oil, and scalp health can help, especially for mild cases. And no matter what, results take months, not weeks. The key is consistency, patience, and tracking, because hair doesn't regrow.
grow overnight, but with the right plan and the right data, improvement is possible. Minoxidil isn't the only path to hair regrowth. Your options are wider than you think, from advanced medicine to natural remedies to lifestyle changes. But the real secret isn't the treatment itself, it's sticking with it long enough and knowing if it's actually working. Thanks for watching. And remember, when it comes to hair, patience plus tracking equals progress.